Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. FBI, Ah, Undertale! We're back again! This is part three! And I riz up Papyrus! What do you think of my secret style? I love it. No! A genuine compliment! Oh. I meet a handsome bloke at a bar. But who is this handsome looking gentleman? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. And I flub my words as usual. Yo! <laughs> you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a stupid shirt. <laughs> it said striped. <laughs> <laughs> Don't miss it! Oh my god, we're back in Undertale. Hi, Bruh. Vegeta. Hello, my quality is less than 144p. Well, uh, it is? What do you mean? Is the, is the stream bad quality? No, because the game is in 16-bit. Oh, right, yeah, good point. Oh, this controller feels nice. I got a new controller. It feels awesome. Really? Yeah. Oh, look, a bunny. Uh, who's voicing this one, Vegeta? I'll take it. <clears throat> you should do Bugs Bunny or something. <laughs> That's a female Kakarot. Yeah, well, so what? <laughs> no, I can't. I got it. <clears throat> Hello, traveler. How can I help you? I don't know. Buy? What Ooh. would you like to buy? Uh, let's see. Armor? It has abs on it. Manly bandana? What? I guess you should. I guess you should buy the armor. It, it's it's plus seven defense. Oh wow, that's pretty good. And then what about this? A bicycle? Uh, oh, it's a bicycle. You can eat it twice. Oh. Like a, like a popsicle, but it's a bicycle. Should I get it? Um, if it counts as two healing items, then sure. Sure, why not? Cinnamon bun. Is that a, I think that's another healing item. It's pretty good, actually. 22 HP. I feel like it's not as good as this, though. That's, that's 22 as well, but it's cheaper. Because you get two bites. So it'd be cheaper to buy that. I suppose so. Guess I'll buy another one of those. You're carrying, oh, you're carrying too, much. too much. Aw, damn it. All right, well, let's exit out of here, then. Huh? Sale something? Does this look like a pawn shop? Why does everything sound southern in this game? I don't know how it works, where you come from, but everything sounds southern down here. If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Oh, well, well, fair play. Let's talk. Hiya. Welcome to Snow Den. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? No, I'm here with Vegeta. Or Vegeta's here with me since he's playing, technically, even though I'm playing. Yes, I am not by myself. I am here with my good friend, Shinron. Oh, what? Shinron? He's here? Yeah, I am. Yeah. I'm just kind of you know, chilling he's doing in the flowy, back. remember? Oh, well, yeah, he was. Yeah, I, I didn't know you came back, Shamron. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've been here the whole time. You, you, you didn't notice me? No. I'm, I'm huge. What the hell? It's uh, okay, oh. Shinron. I'll always notice you. Oh, uh, thank you, Vegeta. No, I really appreciate it. You're a good friend to me. Am I a good oh, friend, Shamron? No, f*** you. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, by the way, by the way, now's probably a good time as any. Viewers at home, if I sound a little off today, it's because I'm a little under the weather. Oh, yeah. However, it's all right. I'm still okay. I'm still here, and we're still gonna knock this game out of the park. Hell yeah! That's the, that's the spirit, Vegeta. Don't let those Saiyan sniffles knock you down. Absolutely. Let's see what to do here. You wanna know what to do here in Snowden? I I, I certainly do. Grillby's has food, and the library has information. Oh? If you're tired. You can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. Oh. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. Oh, boy. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. Huh? The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Oh, yeah, I bet. Uh, let's see. Town history. Think back to your history class. Uh, I don't think I had history class. Uh, I was raised in the woods. I slept in Durgit. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. I mean, I just came from there, but you know. Yeah. Your Sweet life? Goat woman hooked us up with a house there and some pie. She was very nice. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? 
Hmm. As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. Huh. That's life, ain't it? Yeah, I think it is. Bye now. Come again sometime. See, she is Southern. Bye now. It's uh, a Southern thing. Is it? Bye now? Everyone said. Yes. Yeah, oh, yeah, bye, like, now. bye now. Y'all come back now, you hear? No, this must be her sister that she was on about. Oh, yeah. Look at the little cute bunny rabbit. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Uh, I don't know. Uh, who's doing this one? I've done two voices so far, Kakarot. You take it away. Yeah, welcome to Snowden. <laughs> Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 80 gold. Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up, pal. Doc. <laughs> why, why am I just face down on the cover? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, uh, oh, uh, God, I can't get a, you can't get any sleep in here, Vegeta. What is that? Are they farting in unison? I think they're, I think that guy's snoring a song. Oh, I can't move, by the way. Hiya, Doc. You look like you've had a great sleep, which is incapable, but... Wait, wait. Which is incredible. <laughs> I can't read. <laughs> Which is incredible because you, you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back, Doc. You can pay me if you, you're going to stay overnight. Uh, thank you. Who's this person? That lady over there. Something, <laughs> some, something about her disturbs me. Uh, hello there. Is it my little cinnamon bun? Just the cutest. Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> they are. Who's this guy? Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree-like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's, tradi now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Oh, all right. Fair enough. <coughs> that kid kind of looks like you. You should voice him, too. <laughs> Yo! You're a kid, too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a stupid shirt. <laughs> it said striped. <laughs> it said really? striped. It did not say stupid. Edit it. Go back. It said striped. I thought it said stupid. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. I know that guy. Oh, yeah. He's pretty cool. Yeah, he is. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. <laughs> Okay, what's in here? Oh, I know this place. Oh, I Ooh. love this tune. Yeah, me too. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and hot guys! What? what? We're, we're centuries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. <laughs> because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and affection. Oh, that's cute. I'm thinking of getting a spike collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. I agree. <laughs> Editor, zoom into my face. I want to do it too. <laughs> Perfect. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. How do you lose against yourself? I don't know. You must really be a loser. Who the hell's this guy? Oh, put out a lot <laughs> for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with the fish. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. Oh no. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Fair enough. And who is this handsome looking gentleman? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, no, I, I got it, I got it. Isn't human food different from monster food? It does finding, it does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're gonna start moving here. Hmm, I don't wanna see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely wanna see some city slickers slip to their butts. You know, he actually looks like you made him sound. I don't know if that makes any sense. No, that makes perfect sense. That's what I was going for. Yeah, yeah, I liked it. The jukebox is broken. Oh, well, where's this music coming from? All right, well, I'll see you guys later. Everyone's always laughing and cracking jokes trying to forget our modern crisis. Oh, dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? 
No, oh, fair enough. Uh, That's up? a positive way of thinking. I don't see why not. Ooh, what's this? Let's play Masters and Human. Ah, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. You are gonna make me be the human again, are you? Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. FBI, open up! Ooh. Ah, uh, ring, ring. Uh, uh, hello, can I speak to get... Wait a second. This is the wrong number. Oh, it's the wrong number, the wrong number song. We very, very sorry that we got it wrong. Click, click. Wow. Okay. That was very fun. <laughs> that was random. <laughs> library? The library bee. What? Li the library bee. Br br oh, it does say that. Well, that's unfortunate. Now look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? <laughs> I love working at the newspaper. There is so little to report that we just fill it in with comics and games. Okay. <laughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Blip. Uh, welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Well, I'm glad you are aware of this. That uh, is a very stuffed mailbox. <laughs> very much so, yes. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. Yeah, thanks, narrator. I knew that. Yeah, you're welcome. This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Oh. Look inside. Should we? Kind of feels like Should intruding. All right, hopefully he's okay with it. It's, it's empty. Oh, it's that's, a, that's depressing. Yeah, me too. It's locked. Is this Papyrus's house? I think so, yes. I mean, it's right next to his mailbox, Kakara. It's locked from the inside. Someone's in there! Whoa. I don't know if I like this. I oh, can't wait. see anything! It's Papyrus! It's Papyrus. Human! Uh, Allow yes. me to tell you about some complex feelings. Uh, feelings like uh, the joy of finding another pasta lover, uh, the admiration for another's puzzle-solving skills, uh, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, human, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... Um... No, no, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Well, all right then. Oh, I gotta find him? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Go ahead and press act to beat this freak of the week. Oh, Come yeah. Out, give it all we got. Let's do we'll it. We'll give Papyrus a battle. Well fought. Ooh, ooh. That, well, don't insult him. Insult him? I said don't insult him. Okay, let's flirt with him, I guess. What? F f fl flirting So, you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, well I I'm a skeleton with very high standards. Hey, I, I, I can make spaghetti, my boy. Oh, no! You're meeting all my standards! <laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date late later, after I capture you. Um... Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Uh, flirt. Oh, no! Let's date it later, after I capture you! I have a question, uh, Kakarot. I think... Yeah? Because Toriel was a boss, right? Uh-huh. And you had to spare her a bunch, right? He said the same thing when you flirted with him again. He did. Uh, try sparing him instead. Sparing him? I can yes. try that. Mercy. So... You won't fight. Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Um, yeah, you, this is a uh, pretty easy papyrus. Um, oh shit! Yeah, what the? You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. Uh oh. I guess I have to act, or do I just try and? F uh, uh, I think flirt with him more. I mean, uh, spare him more. Sorry. Ah, make your mind up. Hmm, I wonder what I should wear. Hup. 
Yep. Huh? Ah, damn it, I messed it. up. How did I do that? Wait a minute, you have 22 out of 20 HP. You're fine. Huh? How did that help? I mean, it happened. Papyrus dabs marinara sauce behind his ear. Try oh. holding up the up button and to jump. I got it. <laughs> Woo! Papyrus dabs MTT brand bishy, bitchy cream. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he dabs bitchy cream behind his ear. Absolutely. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Uh, I think you are. I, think you're, I feel like you're lying. He's definitely thinking about that date thing. Uh, oh! 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 God, it. that was kind of difficult. Papyrus dabs MTT brand anime powder behind his ear. Oh, that's the best. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Uh-oh. It's Flappy Bird. It's Flappy Bird. Papyrus dabs MTT brand cute juice behind, the ear, behind his ear. Weird. I can almost taste my future popularity. So you're not tasting that cute juice? No. Oh, I gotcha. Ah! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> No one came out of nowhere. Papyrus dabs MTT brand attraction slime behind his ear. What the? F Papyrus is gonna smell like a fucking freak. <laughs> he, he he is. Papyrus, head of the royal guard. Woo. Papyrus dabs MTT brand beauty yogurt behind his ear. Christ. Papyrus doesn't have ears. <laughs> Good point. He doesn't have ears. Papyrus unparalleled spaghetti 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 ah skeletor ah <laughs> <laughs> oh I didn't know what to do I was so confused <laughs> the king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile and my penis fuck how did you hit Ow, I ow. don't know. Papyrus is rattling his bone. My brother, well, he won't change very much. Da, 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 da. That was hard. Papyrus is considering his options. I'll have lots of admirers, but... Bum, 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 ba, da, ba, ba. Oh, come on, part's come my on. Part. Come on. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Well, hurry up and use it already. Am I supposed to lose this or something? No, you're not. Uh, are you sure? Why would you? Why, why, why would you? Why, why are you supposed to lose? Well, why is why this would going you be on so long? Lose? Why would you be supposed to lose? I can't. Well, do I this. don't know. Papyrus is rattling his bones. Not too long, and I'll use that special attack. See, he st he keeps saying new things. Yeah, I suppose. Behold my special attack. Uh. uh what the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Papyrus is getting ready for a regular attack. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack. Ah! 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 Ooh! Ah! Ooh! Ah! Ooh! Ah! Ooh! Oh my god, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna oh. I am so gonna Hope die! Ah! Cool! No! Dude. No, I'm gonna die! Vegeta, help me! Oh, Kakarot, what jump! Jump, Kakarot! Jump! Keep jumping! What's that? What don't the go hell? to the edge! Don't go to the edge! Don't go to the edge! Oh, oh, I said don't go How to am the I bone. on to Oh. What is that? It's just a bone, <laughs> Kakarot. What are you scared of? Go poke it. I don't wanna poke it. Go poke it. Go poke it. Go poke it. Why? <laughs> You're too weak. I was easily able to capture you. I will now send you to Capture Zone. Or, as Sans calls it, our garage. You're in the doghouse now. <laughs> <laughs> what does that sound? I don't even know. <laughs> it's a squeaky chew toy. No. Also, a piece of paper. It's a note from Papyrus. Sorry, I have to lock you in the guest room until Undyne arrives. Feel free to make yourself at home. 
Refreshments and accommodations have been provided. Nearly yours, Papyrus. Fortunately, it's just dry food. Oh, well, that's not very good. It's too small to sleep on. Well, these aren't very good envi uh, thingies. Okay, well, I guess we can leave. <laughs> wow, great job, Papyrus. Okay, what's over here? Wait, we're gonna... I think you gotta fight him again. Again? Because he, well, he captured you. True. Now oh, look, it is him. Now, where could that human have got to? Ah, there you are. You're right in front of me. You're not supposed to be here. You get back there right now. A few minutes later. Uh, there you go. Don't go to the edge. Remember, don't go to the edge. Don't go to the edge. Uh, Perfect. Now, actually jump over the bone at the end this time. I did that, then you told me to hit the damn thing. Yes, I was yeah. joking. Well, don't do that. <laughs> don't joke? Okay. Well, <laughs> it's clear you can't <laughs> defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. I'm not wearing boots. Whatever. Therefore, I, the Great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. And there we go. Papyrus is sparing you now. Okay, fair enough. Yes, and the blizzard is done. No! I can't even stop someone as weak as you! A knight's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the royal guard. And my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What a fucking loser. I'm kidding, let's be no. friends, man. Come on. All right, let's, let's be, be friends. friends. Really? You want to be friends? With, with me? Well, well then, I, I guess, I, I guess I can make an allowance for that. Wow, we, we haven't even had our first date. And I've already managed to hit the friend zone. That's not how that works, buddy. Who knew that I, all I needed was to make pals? Was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the service. <laughs> and I'll give you the Declaration of Independence. <laughs> <laughs> Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical <laughs> seal trapping us all underground. Bless you. Thank you, Papyrus. No problem, Saiyan. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul, like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king Burger of king? all the monsters. He oh. is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> <laughs> this is pretty acrobatic. Um, should we go have that date with him before we leave or just leave? Let's, let's go date the guy, why not? All right, screw it, let's do it. I'm sure the fans would want us to date the guy. Yeah, let's date Papyrus. Is he in here? Please don't enter the mysterious shack. Well, there he is. So you came to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Just add some goofy cartoon sound effects of them running. <laughs> He doesn't know where to go. <laughs> My house! <laughs> <laughs> ah, I love this guy. I love him. Oh, wow, what a great house. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. Someone's going Super Saiyan in the top right in that room. Yeah, it's us. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Uh, Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches! Move it to your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay. <laughs> it's still here! Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! Okay. 
Ah. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. You touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside of the couch. You got 20 gold. God damn. Oh, wow. <laughs> I have 20 dollars in this couch. What's in here? Oh, it's the kitchen. Oh, look. What's in the trash? That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. God damn. <laughs> My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried making something. It was like a quiche, but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd. That's an empty pie tin inside the stove. It sounds like my house, Vegeta. It does, doesn't it? Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. <laughs> <laughs> what? Catch that meddling canine. Curses. <laughs> Sons! <laughs> Stop breaking my life with incidental music! Okay. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please, pursue my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Oh. <laughs> okay, you need to stop! Stop it right now, this instant! I'm getting really tired of this! <laughs> What, what the hell is that? going on? <laughs> Hold on, talk to him now. I can't feel my legs. <laughs> that must mean I'm being a great host. <laughs> it's a joke book. Take a look inside. Hell yeah, I love a good joke. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> What the hell? It's a quantum physics joke. Um, which room now? A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. My penis. <laughs> <laughs> the door's locked. All right, well, I guess we're going in here. That's my room. If you're finished looking around, we can go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside? Yes. Let's do it. Oh, his room's awesome. His room is really awesome, actually. I love that pirate flag. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it basically just happened. <laughs> the internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. It's definitely sans. It's absolutely sans. The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. Oh. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> Something like that, Papyrus. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right, Santa! Wait, you're Santa in your world too? That's pretty cool. A chubby, smiling man who likes to surprise people. True. Is there an Undertale version of that? Apparently. Sans? So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Begin the date? No, let's look around a bit more first. Take yeah, your time. I'll, I'll wait for you. That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. Excellent wordplay. I want to see this door. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. Look in the closet. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh, that's nice. Let's start this date then. Let's do it. Okay, dating start. Oh. Dating start. Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press the C button on your keyboard for the dating HUD. Uh, oh. What's that on, what's that on controller? Uh, the start button, apparently. 
It's Tuesday. Is it actually it's, Tuesday? It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. It, bro? It's Tuesday. Whatever. Wowee, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. <coughs> Human, I, the great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yeah, sure, whatever. Huh, re really? Wowee! I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Hmm. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. <gasps> no! Could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yeah, sure, I'll let you believe that. Ah! Ah! No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! Your dating power! It's over 9,000! Yeah! Hey, what the fuck? That's trademarked. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you bested me yet! I, the Ray Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! <laughs> wow. I hate it. <laughs> I also don't like it. He looks like Yamcha. He does. Um, say... Uh, say I love it, I guess. What do you think of my secret style? I love it. No! A genuine compliment! Oh. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. When he talks, his hat doesn't move. I think his secret <laughs> Wait, might be in that hat. Really? Yes. But that won't happen. So you want to check his hat? Sure. I kind of want to see, uh, what's under everything else. You want to see his bone? <laughs> <laughs> He's made entirely out of bones. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. What do you think it said before? It just said dude, but and that's oh. it. There's no secret in my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. I see, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart, but who doesn't? My hat? My, my hat? My hat? Found it. <laughs> well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Do you know what this is? Of course kinda, I know what it is. Kind of looks a bit like spaghetti. That's what it is. He's papyrus. He's all about spaghetti. Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right, but oh so wrong. This ain't any plain old spaghetti. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti finely aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. I refuse to eat that. The last spaghetti you made was stuck to the table. I think I'm good, fam. Wait, shall I actually refuse this time? Yes, I actually refuse. I, I'm not eating that. All right. You mean you're letting me have it instead? Sure, why not? Because you know how much I love pasta? Go for Impossible! It. Taking my presents and turning it all around me. Dramatic finish! Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Okay. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Now, if you were a skeleton of Bulma, then this would be a different story. I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus, I... Um, boy, is it hard in here, or is it just me? Oh, shoot! Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. <gasps> Romantically, I mean. Yeah. What the hell? You led us on? You, 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 this whole you, time? You 
cock, you despicable person! <laughs> Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark poison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No. Wait, that's wrong. I can't fail and do anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like all this never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true, but I'll help you settle for second best, like my brother Sans over here. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime, platonically. Well, gotta go. <laughs> well, I got blue balled. You're yellow. I, I see that, Vegeta. Wait a minute, let's go talk to Sans. I don't think you can. Oh. Where is Papyrus anyway? Did he just leave? Oops. I think he left the house, yes. He does that. Well then, what now? Should we save and call it here and do the rest in the next video? Yeah, sure. It's enough for one video. Absolutely. So, Vegeta, would you like to do the outro? Um, stay tuned for more Big Banging content. And as always, thanks a bunch for hanging out today. Means a lot. And remember, if you're having a hard time or you just need a good laugh, come back here anytime. Nothing is stronger than a good smile. Also, Kakarot, you wanna do this one with me? Uh-huh. Make sure to give that bell icon a Super Saiyan Punch! And you'll be notified whenever I post the next video. Or, well, he posts the next video. Yeah. But I'm also here. Well, Hi. until we meet again, guys, Vegeta and Kakarot out. Out. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.